Here's an update on my hard shelled gourds, my miniature gourds, and my miniature pumpkins. Over here I have <clears throat> my apple gourds. There's ten hills of the apple gourds. They're all pretty small. They had a slow start. But they've been coming up nicely. And then over here, we have the speckled swan gourds. There's ten hills of those two. They're about the same stage as the apple gourds. Because they took a while to come up. But they're doing pretty well. And then over here on the fence, on this chain link fence, I'm growing my birdhouse gourds. And they are farther along. They've been planted longer than the other gourds over there. But they're doing really, really well. I think the best that I've ever grown with birdhouse gourds. They haven't started climbing the fence yet, but it won't be long. I like to grow them on the fence because if you grow them on the fence and they have, when the gourds start growing, they'll be long and straight. They won't be curved or you won't have any funny shaped ones. Sometimes it happens on the ground. And also it keeps them off the ground from rotting or anything to get to them. And then over here on this cow panel, I call it. I don't know what the really name is for it, but I have my baby boo pumpkins. Which are the miniature white pumpkins. They're doing okay. The bugs seem to be getting to them, so I'm going to treat them for that. And then over here, like this is where the fence ends, that side. Baby Boo, this side's Jack B. Little, and Jack B. Little are just miniature orange pumpkins. And they are not doing too great. Not very many of them came up, and the ones that have come up, the bugs have completely gotten. So I'm going to treat for them, and hopefully they'll kind of get out of this. But they're just not doing very well at all. And last year I didn't have very good luck with the Jack B. Littles as well. But some of them are just not doing very well. And kind of the same thing with my miniature gourds. These are all, this whole fence right here are my miniature gourds. Some of them are doing really well, and then some of them are, see that one's doing great, and then like this one. It's not doing so great because the bugs. So I don't know, hopefully they'll get out of this. I'll treat them and see if that helps. But the gourds go all the way down here. All the way down to here. So I planted a lot of miniature gourds. Hopefully they'll be okay though. But anyway, that's my update on my birdhouse gourds, speckled swan gourds, apple gourds, miniature gourds, and my miniature pumpkins. So... I will give another update on them in a few weeks.